Godin is a long-term target for Manchester United, while reports in Italy have claimed Inter Milan are on the verge of agreeing a deal to sign him. The Uruguayan, 32, is said to be unhappy because Atletico have not offered him a new contract. Predict five results and win £25,000 free to play here after United bid for him in the summer, it is claimed he asked for improved terms to bring his wages in line with the club's highest earners. His current deal expires in the summer and he is free to leave in the summer. However, Simeon is hoping they can come to some sort of resolution. Both Atleti and the player are seeking the best solution for all parties, he said. The club and God know what I think about this. If he does remain with us, it'll be because it's best for him and the club. United will be keeping a close eye on developments as they are desperately looking for reinforcements in defence. Before he was sacked, Jose Mourinho tried to bring a new centre back to the club but was left frustrated by the board after they failed to secure any of his targets. Mourinho was keen on Harry Maguire from Leicester, Tottenham's Toby Alderweireld and Bayern Munich star Jerome Boateng. However, United Chiefs did not believe any of them to be value for money or an upgrade on the players already at the club. That stance appears to have changed, and they have been linked with a host of Europe's most sought-after defenders. Napoli's Caladu Calibali is said to be high on their list of targets, but the Senegalese would probably command a fee that would make him the world's most expensive defender. Milan's Skriniar from Inter Milan would be a cheaper option and United are reported to be tracking his progress.